Hello and welcome to the February Illumicrate unboxing. I am a rep for Illumicrate. If you would like to receive 5% off the three to six month subscription, you can use my code booksnest5 at checkout. Let's have a look inside. The theme is caged hearts. The first item is a something designed by Fez Inkwright. I have no idea what. Oh wait, hang on. Death was everywhere in the house of night by Carissa Broadbent is a quote on the top. I'm assuming it's like a tumbler type of thing probably. It is a tumbler type of thing, probably. With a silicone thingy straw. <laughs> okay, sorry. So it says that quote, whatever I just read out, death was everywhere in the house of night. I don't know if you're gonna be real, really able to see the design or just, hello, see me through it, but there are purple snakes and flowers on it, I think. See, it kind of looks like something out of Zelda, the, the muddle thing. I don't know if anyone plays Tears of the Kingdom, it looks like a plant from that. And I'm quite enjoying this, to be honest with you. <laughs> this is item number one! <laughs> item number two, I feel like, is a dagger. Ooh, wait. It's not, well, it kind of, it is, but it's like, oh, that's gotta be Percy Jackson themed, right? It's a trident daggery thingy. That's so cool. Oh no, it isn't. It's Alton's from the Poppy War. Okay. This is designed by Stacey McAvoy Kant, and this is Alton's trident replica which is very cool. Is it pointy? It's a, It's actually quite pointy. You know what? If you're in a tight spot, ah. <laughs> I'm joking, please do not use this if you're in a tight spot. I quite like this. I wanna find a place to display this to make my enemies cower in fear. I don't think I have any enemies. I hope I don't have any enemies, but they will cower in fear. Okay, next we have Fairy Tale Feast Keyring inspired by the Book Eaters by Sonny Dean. It's got a little bite taken out of it. Oh, that's so cute. I really like that. I love the rose gold and the green together. This is designed by Marta Vale. That's so cute. Then we have got this, a clear pencil case. Okay, is that literally what it is? It is a little pencil case? Travel case. Oh, right, for the airport, because you have to have it clear. Got it. So one side is like completely clear and then the other side has a design on it, which is like a chicken's foot, maybe? Again, I don't know if you can be able to tell or just see me through it, but this, oh, a crow's foot. It's called a crow's foot pouch, which is a lovely name. <laughs> so this is designed by Gretchen Kobaug, and this is to store your toiletries or reading supplies on the go and is inspired by one dark window. Okay, yeah, I don't really feel like it's gonna be airport compliance, so maybe ignore what I said on that one, but it's a clear pouch thing to put your crow's feet in. <laughs> It is time for the book. This is heavy. Okay, this is To Cage a God by Elizabeth May. We have got a really beautiful rib cage with some stuff coming out of it on the front. The back says, To Cage a God is divine. To be divine is to rule. To rule is to destroy. Which I feel like if you said it in Smaug's voice would work quite well. And these are these spreaders, which are like a stained glass window. Those are very pretty. I'm gonna see what it's like under the dust jacket. Ooh, this feels really thick. <laughs> Like the cover, and if it's, I, I can't explain it. If you've also got this box, please let me know if you also think this book is like heavier than a normal book of this page count. I'm doing a bad job of showing you. It's very pretty. The end pages are also beautiful. I have never heard of this book. I have no idea what it's about. Let's find out together. Oh, oh, it's very Snow Queen esque. Using ancient secrets, Galena and Sarah's mother grafted gods into their bones, bound to brutal deities and granted forbidden power no commoner has held in a millennia. The sisters have been raised as living weapons. Now the time has come for them to overthrow an empire, no matter the cost. With their mother gone and their country on the brink of war, it falls to the sisters to take the helm of the rebellion and end the cruel reign of a royal family possessed by destructive gods. Because when the ruling Illyria invade, they conquer with fire and blood, and when they clash, common folk burn. While Sarah reunites with her estranged lover who now leads the rebellion, Galena infiltrates the palace. In this world of deception and danger, her only refuge is an, isol is an isolated princess whose whip-smart tongue and sharp gaze threaten to uncover Galena's secret. Torn between desire and duty, Galena must make a choice of work together to expose the lies of the empire or bring it all down. Is that an LGBT romance it forming in there I catch the drift of? I don't know, but it sounds like it could be. This is the Illumicrate exclusive edition, which is a signed royal hardback, features an exclusive cover from the publishers, end paper artwork by Rin, Rin Fushi, different from front and back, foil design on the case by Ros Dottir, digital printed four edges by Chatty Nora, and bonus content. I can never decide how I feel about bones 
on book covers, like skulls on book covers, not a massive fan, I don't find like a skull a pretty thing to look at on a book cover. I mean this rib cage isn't exactly pretty but I am intrigued by it because it's got some runes on it and the more I look at it the more I see. Like I think there's a snake inside it, there's like an eye coming through, look there's so much more to look at. The more I stare the more I'm noticing more things and I'm intrigued. I like the colour scheme, generally this is my favourite part of the book. I mean the book sounds good too but like the stained glass windows, red edges, are stunning. I'm actually finding this quite difficult to pick my favourite item because the dagger thing, I just, I really love the the look of that but I think honestly the key ring, I love that. I really really like that key ring. I loved the book, I love the design, I love the colour and I love the fact there's a little bite taken out of the book so I just think that's great. As I said I am a rep for Illumicrate so if you'd like to receive 5% off the 3-6 month subscription you can use my code BOOKSNEST5 at checkout. Thank you so much Illumicrate for sending me this box and thank you all for watching this video, I will see you in the next one.